In this problem, we have a linear equation, this guy right here. And we're being asked to tell whether these ordered pairs are solutions to that equation. Now remember, when you have an ordered pair, the first number is always the x, the second number is always the y. That's what this means right up here. So if something is a solution, it means you can take the x value and the y value, plug them into the equation for x and y, and the equation is true. So let me show you how that works. Here we have is x is 0. So instead of 7x, I would write 7 times 0. And then y is negative 4. So instead of 3y, I would write 3 times negative 4. And then I would still set that all equal to 11. So this thing I've just written is really this equation with 0 and negative 4 plugged in for x and y. And now we just need to do the arithmetic. Oop, this should be 11, not 1. Now we need, just need to do the arithmetic. 7 times 0 is easy. That's just 0. So I don't even need to write that. A negative 3 times a negative 4 is going to be a positive 12. So I get 12 equals 11. And 12 does not equal 11. So this is not a solution. Let's try negative 2, 7. So I'll rewrite this equation again. 7 times the x value of negative 2 minus 3 times the y value of 7 equals 11. So 7 times negative 2 is negative 14. Negative 3 times 7 is negative 21. And I can see already this is not going to be a positive 11. This is going to be a pretty big negative number, negative 35. Uh, so that doesn't work either. All right, let's try 5 and 8. So rewriting the equation again, 7 times the x value of 5 minus 3 times the y value of 8 equals 11. 7 times 5 is 35. And negative 3 times 8 is negative 24. Aha, 35 minus 24 is 11. That one works. So this is a solution. Let's try this next one, negative 1 and negative 6. So 7 times negative 1 minus 3 times negative 6 equals 11. Well, 7 times negative 1 is negative 7. A negative 3 times a negative 6, negative times a negative is a positive. So that's a positive 18 equals 11. So this is really like 18 minus 7. That is 11. So this one works too. So this is also a solution to the equation.